here at McNeese State University, home of the Cowboys, as they are preparing for another year of a lot of football. And tomorrow kicks off their first game of the season. And you can't have a football game without the band. Here with me, I have Tim Pardue, band director at McNeese. Tim, tell me what's in store for you guys, especially with this football season. Uh, we're starting out the season celebrating the music of Earth, Wind & Fire, classic 70s band. Uh, later in the season, we're going to be playing music by Journey to celebrate their 50th anniversary as a band. And then we're going to close out uh, our season with a salute to Broadway featuring music from Hamilton and Wicked. Uh, it's going to be great. Uh, tomorrow, to start off the season, we've got 200 local high schoolers from the region, from Texas, Louisiana, and Arkansas, uh, coming to join us to perform with us for halftime. It's wow. Going to be great. So how many do you have in the band? Uh, about 130 this year. So that's going to be a very big group performing at tomorrow's halftime performance. What can we expect? Kind of tell me a little bit about it. Uh, it's going to be great at halftime. They're going to join us after we perform Earth, Wind & Fire music. And we're going to actually be playing Elton John's I'm Still Standing. Uh, it's going to be great. So it's going to be a great time. And I know there's a lot to do tonight, you know, before we go into it, like the block party and everything. But I hope everyone will come out, watch the halftime show. Tell me if someone at home wants to join and wants to be a part of the band next year, how do they do that? Uh, they can look up our information at McNeeseBands.com, send uh, either myself or uh, Tim Pardew an email or Davron Edwards, our assistant director. We'll set up an audition, get you in. Yay, that's so exciting. So before we go, can I have a sneak peek of something we might hear tomorrow ahead of the big game? Absolutely. This is something you're going to hear a lot with all the touchdowns. All right, here we go. <laughs> For more information on tomorrow's big game in Lake Charles, Angelica Butine, 7 News.